As we head into the day of day in Vegas weekend, we're getting an update on the Astro World tragedy, discussing artist and promoter liability with Eric Palacios, the sponsors of this next segment. Check, check it out. Hey, Eric, welcome back. Thanks for having me. Unfortunately, we have to discuss Astro World because today we heard there was a ninth death at the concert festival. So let's just talk about the liability here. Um, you know, are the artists and pr promoters of these shows liable for injuries and deaths, unfortunately? Uh, it depends. Generally, no, uh, because on the back of your ticket, uh, you will have a disclaimer that says you're participating in an activity that is inherently dangerous and you may suffer injury or even death. So in order for there to be liability, uh, you have to show extreme negligence on the part of the artist, the venue, the promoter, uh, or even recklessness. And of course, at Astro World, Travis Scott shows they're known for those mosh pits. So coming up for Day in Vegas this weekend, you know, what should what should people know about sufficient negligence um, via the artist or the promoters? Well, the artist, the promoters, the venue needs to know what type of show they're putting on. If mm -hmm. they're going to have a mosh pit, if they know people are going to get excited and jump around and push and shove, if it's a tough crowd, then they need to have adequate measures in place. That being security, uh, that being uh, levels of filling the venue, sometimes leaving some empty spaces, uh, just so they can compensate for that uh, extra uh, uh, anxious crowd. Uh, so it's important for the people to know who their audience is going to be and take the necessary precautions. Any advice for concert goers, you know, especially for this weekend? Yes, we know a lot of people come to Vegas. Some venues or concerts are hundreds of thousands uh, for some festivals. Uh, basically, know where you're at at all times. If you see the artist coming up as one of those that generates a lot of intensity and you don't want to be in the middle of it, take a step back. Always be aware of your surroundings. Don't get caught in the middle of something that you don't feel comfortable in or that can be a danger uh, to your health. So just important to always be around your group of friends and be aware of what's going on around you. Absolutely. Follow that intuition and keep your eyes and ears open, right? That's it. And be safe out there. Be safe out there, number one. For more information, give Eric Palacios and Associates a call at 702-444-7777. You can also visit their website at ericpalacioslaw.com.